To get the most efficient use out of Lightroom, it's important to use some of the short keys. So here are my top five that might not be in your workflow. First up is survey mode. I've talked about this mode in a previous video, but shortcutting with the N key on selected images will help you narrow down your final selections. There are two main viewing modes in the library module, either loop or grid mode, with loop giving you a clearer and larger view of your images. You can shortcut between these by using the E key for loop or the G key for grid. As well as smart collections, again, this is something I've discussed in a previous video, you can also add images to a quick collection. You can do this by selecting the image or images you want and then pressing the B key. You might want to do this instead of taking the time to set up a smart collection if you only want to temporarily group some of the images together before exporting. During your edit, you can look back at the original image by pressing the backslash key. It's good to be able to compare where your image started from and where it's at now. And the final one I use is during the edit phase. Press the J key and this will show you the area of the image you are losing due to clipping either the blacks or the whites, giving you a better idea of how your exposure is looking. I hope you found these short keys useful. Don't forget to check out the rest of the Lightroom Tips series with Wexphoto Video.